Welcome back, Ursadai Gamer here, and we are back with Moonscars. Because I'm doing pretty good, getting pretty far. My body's gone, and I kind of want to know where the hell my body went. Because, yeah, that, that seems like a big issue. So, I'm going to upgrade, and I'm going to hopefully figure out where the hell my body went. You're not going to speak to me? Okay. Oh, wow. Wow. No! Oh, wow, that really hurt. Oh, wow, you're putting up a good fight, aren't you? Got you! Yeah, I am the real one. I'll take... I'll take the spear again. Up I go. That is obviously a trap. Right? He's not acting hostile. That's weird. What's up? You want to be my friend? Are you a good boy? You're not going to hurt me? Well, unfortunately, I'm going to hurt you. Pile drive! I regret my choices! Oh! Ah! Oh! I'm... No! No! Let's activate that. Heal that. Go, doppelganger. You're on my side this time. And you died. Interesting that the body was there for so long. That was a bit unnerving. Ha <laughs> ha. I am the victor. But that is, that is useful. It acts like me. Pretty handy. I like this new spell. Open sesame. What's that? What's that below me? What you waiting for? Yeah! That was poorly timed. Sorry, doppelganger. Ow! I like the look you got going. Boom! That's one of you. Spear! Takes basically all my magic, though, to make the doppelganger, which isn't good. And it doesn't last as long as I'd hoped for. I pressed the wrong button. But it's still cool to have. Boom! Get out of here. Is this a gland? Yay, another gland that I'm going to hoard with all the others. This is sus. This is a trap. Oh, more health. This is a good trap. Go! 
got you! And spear time! Oh, I thought I timed that. Well, I guess not. Oh, hi! Oh, it's one of you! No! Mm-mm, not dealing with that, thank you. Oh, it's... This is neat. This is real neat. Okay. Ah, that... That really hurt. <laughs> you can die, too. Ah, oh, they're not done yet. Oh, the bomb ones. Bombs. Back to you guys, I see. Oh. Who's next? Who wants to get chopped? Okay. Doppelganger. Boom! Now get down here so I can really teach you a lesson. Easy peasy. Oh, are you gonna follow me? My doppelganger looks like it's crying. I think I should be concerned about that. Oh, yeah. I feel like that should be something I feel bad about using now. Like, there should be probably a good moral conflict going on. Hello. And the last pristine said, Since I lost parent flesh, I am my own master. And a new parent spawned an offspring. A liberated slave can make only another slave. A slave? What are you talking about? The child came to her parent, confused and troubled, asking the elder, Why did you bring me into being? Why do I live? The answer was an honest, was as honest as it was vile. I live at your expense. Your mistakes make my echo grow. Your delusions make my reality hylic. The child trembled in disbelief. Well, that was a dark tale of existence. I don't appreciate that, thank you. Weird. I can't re-talk to that one. Oh, hi! You're back. Your time has come, wandering clay. Who are you? A doppelganger? I don't remember creating you. Me? Oh, no. It is you. Oh. Oh! Oh, is that my body? Oh, no! Nonsense. Just don't stand on my way. I will return to my body of flesh and leave you be. <sighs> How naive. I am the parent flesh. My time inside the molding machine is over. And flesh does not subject to clay. You have nowhere to return. You will be disposed of as any other doppelganger should be. I have neither urge nor time to deal with you. There are things to be taken care of. Just leave and do whatever you want. Doesn't this conversation seem familiar to you? <laughs> oh, what a fool you are. You know very well that we seek the same thing, the integral vessel that the sculptor needs. We do not have to quarrel over this. And let the sculptor decide who is less cleft. Surely it would be you, the new one. Scales are tipped. 
The old man used to say, mold is meant to overcome parent flesh. <laughs> but look at you now, a miserable thing. You just brought more discord in my stead, one grave mistake after another. All death you've brought about, all lives you took. It's your burden now, not mine. Fine. I will pay my price and go on. Too late, doppelganger. I am all healed now. Thanks to you, I can face anything. And now I am looking at you, seeing nothing but another obstacle. Then the mistake is yours. Happens to everyone. <sighs> okay! Should I really be attacking my body? This seems like a bad idea. If that is my body, this don't seem like a good plan. Oh, wow. Ah, yeah. Okay. I don't want to hurt you. Oh, that's a neat trick. That's cool. Okay. Maybe I can beat you into submission? Oh, you've got all the abilities. That seems a bit unfair. Oh! And spear! Oh, missed. God, she hits hard! Okay, we could be friends. Oh, wow. Okay. We really don't have to do this. We really don't. <laughs> oh, that was just on the tip. Wow. Oh, I keep missing. Okay, I was sure I timed that right. Okay. Oh, no. Oh, no. I... I just... I just killed the immediate cause of my existence. I killed myself. Yeah? Yeah, yeah, I think that was a bad, bad thing to do. Who am I now? Who am I? I am a doppelganger, undefeated, standing over the corpse of the real human with my face. Would I die with the same sorry grimace? I am a child that became a parent flesh. And for the first time, my gland does not hurt. I can even hear my Iker's soothing flow. Um. I don't know if this was a good thing or if there was like a secret option. Like, I... I don't know. Oh, hi, cat and mumbles. I won't be a human anymore, Zoran. I'm trapped in a piece of sentient clay. My ichor, myself, my roots. I lost it with my parent flesh. Such a weird sensation. I do not feel anything change. Clay or flesh, does it matter? Am I blind to the difference? Mm. And my Iker, whatever I had lost, I had I lost. The new self was born in this body. If I am no Irma, then who am I? <sighs> Whoa. 
sculptors here. There is no force outside us to grant us ichor. It grows inside us, the most mundane miracle one can imagine. <sighs> Yet this growth, however eternal, is to be reaped by the ravenous deity. Okay. Was that a hallucination again? An illusion? Or did he actually just pop out of that mumbling one? Find Lajos, kitten. Don't stop when you are so close. You know what, kitty? I like you. I trust you. Don't let me down. Um. The true vessel has been restored. Very good. The fuck do you mean by that? What are... Dark key. Key to the eastern and farthest part of the earth balance. Okay. So I couldn't have gone eastward then without going westward. That's interesting. Also, what... He was here then. The fuck are you doing with the body? Kitty! Kitty, please help me. Okay, you're not saying anything different. I will do it, Kitty. I will find him. Ha! Oh, did the cat just meow at him away? Yeah, fear the cat! Yeah, you better fear that cat. He's a tough kitty. Alright, so... Yeah. Oh, there was down here. But maybe it, this loops to it? I don't know. I am a bit lost. Just a wee bit. Ha ha! You fell for my trap. Hag's eye left. Oh good, I found the other eye! Half blind eye of a certain hag made of specific clay. It can s it may still see things. Well, I don't know if I've found this hag yet. I don't believe I have. But I've got her eyes. More bone powder. Oh, okay. So this just leads back around. And this likely does go down here. So I might go down there after I activate this. Of course it does this. And another doppelganger. Oh, I did have a thing I could give to you. I forgot to give it to you, I think. What happened, sister? You look... How do I look? You look as if you've seen a ghost. A good guess. Your words worry me, sister. Would you like to share with your loyal Vlas Vladislava your troubles? No. No. That's too bad. Too bad. No, but I'll I'll give you a molding machine memory. Yeah, I forgot about that. I wish I knew how the machine works, sister. I bet nobody knows that except the grand miscreant. But I've remembered a curious thing. Long ago, there were rumors that he made it for somebody very special to him. For somebody he loved. <laughs> we can only guess who that was, sister. 
Well, that's kind of odd, but okay. I don't believe there's anything... Oh, hi, child. Why are you here at the machine? Hey, free Irma! Do you know... Do you know that I am... Ah... Uh, a forgery? Do you feel like that? I feel certainly not what I used to. True, I am a lost thing now. Oh, poor Lady Irma. It takes time to get used to it. You see, we are all reflections at the end. Right. Mold of a mold. Why is this child so wise? What do you know? But take a look at this machine. Even with no template inside, it keeps recreating you. How is it possible? Maybe it's same to human birth. What? I don't... We are born empty, void of sense, Irma. And this void needs to be filled. Something in the raw matter just craves for a shape. Craves to be different and thus multiply. <sighs> now you should ask where the first drop of Ica comes from. Where your life starts. From the depths of your body and nowhere else. It's an instinct, a primordial drive to become something. Passing through time, the being is defined by how it differs from others. Every motion leaves its own trail. Some are worms crawling along the blade. Same with the machine. It creates mold after mold as Claiborne's decide to become Irma's over and over. But why me? Why Irma? How do I know? I'm just a little girl. I made my own choice. Yes, and what choice was that, demon? <laughs> you know, you know quite a lot, child. I don't trust you. Oh, I don't trust you at all. I have another thing to give you now. <laughs> You were wrong, priestess. I beg your pardon, sister. She, your goddess, the moon. She is nothing like mother to us. Our Iker belongs to us and us only. Oh. So you are one of the initiated ones now. I guess we should thank little Adelinka for this. I don't get it, priestess. Why would the church feed her flock with lies? Listen to me, dear sister. Since the dawn of time, the clergy taught the commoners simple things. Ica, as Holy Spirit, animates flesh, and we, brothers and sisters, all came from her womb. For the greater good, the bitter truth is meant to be concealed. What is the greater good? Mm -hmm. Serenity, sister. Serenity and acceptance. Think of it. The concept of spirit is just so appealing. Simple minds can't stand that matter begets the essence. That we have no other sense but what we've already created inside of us. Human beings naturally need a beacon to guide. A figure to follow. A beautiful idea. <laughs> and the mistress. A being even greatest needs to feed. We pay with Iker for the order of things that she keeps, for the excess that she cuts a she like a sheep's wool. So simple. Yes, if you are ready to comprehend, I, I reject her guidance. Her light brings only pain and ruin. <laughs> well, it's your call, sister. Go in peace now. I have a feeling you're not going to be all that happy with that rejection later, but we'll see. Hello. So what happened to the other body?
Seriously. What happened to the other doppelganger that I let go? And should I have let it go? Okay, I'm gonna go back down first. Right, I have a quick way to get around. Okay, there's an elevator, that's good. Interesting. Hello. Again, I know my timing is bad sometimes, but I really didn't think I was that far off. That time I was. Oh, are you kidding me? I... Oh my god. Oh my god. I had to come from that way? Okay. I'm going to quickly do that. Hi, who are you? Oh, it's your Emma. Don't stare at me. These scratches are nothing. It was worse during the war. I see you wear them as badges of honor. What are you looking for in the depths anyway? I won't speak on this. Sister is right. There's nobody to trust in the sublunary, sublunary world. Well then, enjoy the lone loneliness. Like, I'm just trying to help you, buddy. <laughs> and you can enjoy walking out of my sight. Your aid is unasked for. Okay. Fuck. <laughs> da 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 da. Like, jeez. I'm just trying to help you out. I'm trying to be friendly. But whatever, my guy. Oh, I got a right leg of the screaming head. That's good that I came all the way back for a leg. But benefit, I'm right back to where I was. Now... Yes, I think I'll go this way. And the body... I think, yeah, that's where the body was. So maybe I'll go up after going this way. Sounds like a plan! Oh, it killed itself. Good. I had forgotten the demon childs. I did not miss them. Ha! Okay. Behind door number one. A lot of nothing. What then? How do I get up here? I guess I don't. Well then. I want to know where it is. You're my friend. You're my friend. No, oh, you're not my friend. Oh, it has been a while since I fought you guys. 
But you're not that tough. It's just been a while. Same with you guys. Easy peasy. That would have made it easier. Oh! Not fall down right away, because that reckless fencer gemstone regular damage increase, but witchery damage decrease. Well, that could be useful. I don't like the noises I hear. Right, I can get rid of these. Still disturbing. And I was up here. I just couldn't get through because it was closed off. But now I can! Because I am mighty! How that explosion hurt me. Ah, yes. Ow. Got rid of the baby. You're easy to follow up on. Ooh, more bone powder. And wherever this leads me to. Oh. Well, that was dumb of me. Oh, someone's here. Who the hell are you? Your face, your kind face seems familiar, Blade Maiden. You are my older sister's friend. Thank you for all of the care you provided to her. Are you locked here? Forgive me, dear Blade Maiden. I should introduce myself proper. I'm Karina, the younger daughter of Zorin the Sculptor. And this is the only place where I belong. Sounds like you're hiding here. Is it wrong to hide when I can aid people that I care about from here? I pray to the gentle mistress and she smiles down at us. You are one of those people that I care about, kind Irma. Please take this. One for you and one for my Adelina. Visit me the next night. I will be waiting for you. Absolution Bonestone. No penalty on death. Oh. Thank you. Memory mold of Karina. Embodied in a strange matter. Reminds Irma of a recluse Karina, the sculptor's youngest daughter. You're... You're a weird one. 
don't forget to bring the cookie to my Adelina. She needs this more than anybody else. And come the next night, or any time you need a moment of peace. Will do! Yeah, sure. I'll be sure to do that. Yep. That's not weird and creepy in any way. Oh, wow. Oh, wow. Back to hitting hard again. Oh. God, man. Get your timing right! How do I do this to myself? Oh, my God. There we go. Timing better. That's better. And we got another door! Wait, is that it? Just this creepy woman and a dead end. Okay. Well, I guess I'll head back here? And here, probably. Yeah, that sounds like an idea. Hey, Queenie, I made it back! The night of our enthronement is coming. It will be a cruel night, gracious Irma. Yes, it will. Slay, queen. Oh, there you are. Still nothing to say, Wanda. Now, I just want to see... Well, you know what? Let's go that way. I might as well. I'm here. It might be a dead end. Super jump! Yeah! Die. I'll get you. Might take me a little bit to get to you, but I will get you. Easy. Is this for the elevator? It is, so... It's kind of a pointless elevator, but it's trying its best, I suppose. <sighs> no! None of that! You guys have hit me far too many times. It's revenge for me now. And boom, yes. Give me that bone powder. Oh, yeah, that, that. Oh god, I forgot you guys don't care about ledges, because you just teleport wherever you want. Ha. Man, 
How can my timing be so good and then so bad at the same time? <laughs> oh, you, you're a red one. You are a red one. Oh, yeah. No. Come here so I can smack you. That's weird. Are you a regular one? Oh, okay. Okay. I thought it was another clone that just glitched into existence. Oh, maybe this just loops around here, where I was going to head anyway? Maybe. Down I go to find out! Enough of you guys. I'm the victor. Okay. Okay, I'll head over here. Uh, maybe I won't. Or maybe I will. You know what? I'll, I'll head left first, then I'll head right. Trap! Whew. Don't die on me, I just summoned you! Oh, wow, that's a lot of damage! Oh, spear! Goodbye. Now I have... Oh, more Iker. Good. Iker, Iker. I still am not entirely sure which way is the right pronunciation. I'm going with Iker. Iker. Yeah. 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 Would have been cool if I smashed through that. Oh, wow, that ooh, did a lot. There's my body. Oh, boy. Jeez, do you have to hurt me so bad? Oh, I hate the healing one so much. Okay. Spear them good. Okay, okay, it's just you and the healer. God damn, that's so much damage. Doppelganger, help me out. 
distract them while I get rid of this damned healer. There we go, that's them. Now you. Good job. Not that. Okay, that was... That's strangely easy. Is this the one I have the key to? Or is it a different one down here that I think I remember trying to open? I hate the flying ones when they're immune to the physical. It's like, how am I supposed to hit them? Oh my god. Jesus, oh wow. Okay, I found the door, my god. Oh, that was dangerously close. Why are you hurting me so damn much? Ah, good. Well, I've lost all of my Iker clay souls. But at least I made it back here with these guys that I am uncertain of how to deal with. Man, that makes me feel good. There. There, now I just gotta do it to the rest of you. Come here. Please come here. Quit being a bag of dicks. Come here. Now, your friend. Oh my god. Why you hurt so bad? Oh my god. Come here. Goodbye. Now. Secret door. I will go left once more. Oh, good. Oh, good. Even better. Okay. Why are you being so laggy? Oh, that was nice and easy. I like that. Your turn, big guy. <laughs> no, I haven't been here. Well, I have been here. But I haven't been there. That's where it seems to want me to go, so I'm going to go right first, just in case. I've made a mistake! Oh, I'm making more! 
Oh, don't kill me now! Don't. Oh, ah. I hate you guys so much. <laughs> oh, God, you are the biggest annoyances in the game so far. No, not the assassin. These ones. These flying, immune, spear-throwing dickheads. Come down. How did... How am I supposed to hit you if you won't come to my level? There. Oh, whoa. Oh, no! Demon child, what killed you? Adelinka. Adelinka. She is dead. No trace of Claiborne's. A human did it. Can't believe she is dead. It wasn't meant to happen. To be honest, if she was speaking the way she was to me earlier, it's like, yeah, this is a possessed child. <laughs> oh, maybe I can revive her. Or put the demon back into her, I don't know. Something not right about the kid. That goes further. I don't know. Feeling brave, my guy? Oh boy, that's good. Oh, oh my god! Good, good. You will be next. I don't know what happened there, because I wanted to use my spear. Good. Smack him dead. That's a big nothing! Oh, wow, that almost killed me instantly! Yeah, you can stay dead. I don't know where this is leading me. This just seems to keep going onward. I'm gonna go back. You weren't there before. But I'm not dealing with you. I'm coming down here. And figuring out where this goes. So good of you to show up. Oh my god. Oh 
why. Got you. Okay. What is the point of this? Weird. Oh, whoa, yep. Jeez. Oh, there's more. Of course there's more. Stop healing them. They don't need your help. They're doing a good enough job beating my ass. Oh, God. Well, my copy is dead, and I'm almost dead, too. Ah, yep. I came back. Oh, yeah, you're right. You're red because of the moon. I forgot about that. Now, how about you tell me about Karina? <laughs> Gentle Karina, the better daughter of the sculptor. Indeed. She is the kindest woman I have ever met. No caveats. But she wasn't like that back in the day when her mother was alive. Surprised? Indeed. The sculptor had a limited interest for earthly women. He never spoke of his wife, though, and never showed her to anybody. The only thing we know about her is that, she, is that her death was violent. Mm. But why did Karina shut herself in? Maybe she didn't want to see how her maddened father violated this land and bent every of its laws. Maybe she refused to accept her mother's death. Or maybe she felt abandoned by her older sister. Who knows? Mm -hmm. What is important? She is hiding from herself, sister. And such a kind of hiding invites beasts most perilous, sister. Okay, good to know. Well, at least I've tied up some of the stories and found out more things. Interesting things. But I think this is all I have time for. I am going to definitely go further into the eastern depths once I get back. But yeah, if you liked this, remember to like, comment, and subscribe. And I will see you as I, again, go further in the depths.